a shirt. Be a good, be a good human. I got it from Meredith from my birthday. I'm underneath the bed again. Uh, Jack is doing his Zelda gameplay, so I'm in the bedroom for prayer corner today. But I just finished mass, and if you go to my Facebook um, profile, you can watch it if you haven't had a chance to um, enjoy service today. So I'm gonna do an angel card. Today is the wedding anniversary of my sweet Rudy in heaven. I've done a lot of crying today, so I think I'll be able to make it okay through prayer corner. But you know me, I have no shame, and if I feel like crying, you will see it. <laughs> but I am so very thankful to have a new love in my life at this moment in time to uh, help me heal this part of my heart during this very, very difficult week. Um, so I just want to give gratitude and um, just a shout out to the Holy Spirit for filling me with peace today and allowing me to purge um, emotions so that they don't get blocked uh, inside our body. It's stagnant energy. So crying is really important. It's very healing. Okay, so we're going to do some angel cards. All right, and uh, let's shuffle it up here. Lord, what would you like to say to us today? Bringing us some peace. Huh, this is interesting. Do you need this? <clears throat> you do not need another's approval to feel worthy of love. Regardless of what you've done or what you think you failed to do, from your soul's perspective, there's neither right nor wrong. Every experience in life is here to help you expand your, your awareness of love so that you may embrace your ever greater spheres of wisdom. You've done nothing wrong. That gives me chills. I feel like a lot of us need to hear that because you can, basically guilt's from the devil. That's what my grandma says. And if we harbor and hold on to all this guilt, you know, we all have a past, you know, um, it becomes a, a a stagnant emotion inside our body that is really harmful for our body and can cause cancer and everything. So <sighs> let that shit go. Excuse my language, per corner, but seriously, it's like not serving us. So you gotta like apologize to yourself, forgive yourself, dig deeper emotionally, cry the tears and give your problems to God so that, you know, he can take it on. He's bigger than anything. So let's do a quick Our Father. I feel like that. Let's just thank the Lord. Come home to a prayer most of us know. <clears throat> Frog in my throat today. love you and we are thankful for all the things you do for us in your guidance for your will in our lives please help us see your movement and your actions help us love each other and love ourselves forgiving ourselves and opening up space to receive your beautiful light Please join me. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation. Deliver us from evil. 
For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, now and forever. Amen. I want you to rub your hands together. Make just like a lot of heat between your hands. Close your eyes. Take a deep breath in. Roll your eyes up to your third eye and try to visualize some light here. Get a good go, 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 go. Fast, 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 fast. Feel that in your hands here. This energy pulsing between your hands. And now lay it on your heart. Breathe into that. Breathe into your own personal energy. Warmth. Bringing in the light of the spirit to re-energize your soul. Let's take a deep breath in. All right, well, let's see. It's only been six minutes. That's pretty awesome. I will pick at Jesus Calling too, because today it's kind of short. <clears throat> All right, well, I open to page June 14th, which is actually the an that's gonna make me cry. The anniversary of uh, we have a ten year anniversary. Um, Rudy and I do of dating. So this is our dating anniversary that I opened to. So let's see what Rudy has to say today. Or the Holy Spirit guiding us to this page, whatever it is. It's so awesome. Okay. I have loved you with an everlasting love. Before time began, I knew you. For years, you swam around in a sea of meaningless searching for love, hoping for hope. All that time, I was pursuing you, aching, in, aching to embrace you in my compassionate arms. When time was right, I revealed myself to you. I lifted you out of the sea of despair and set you down on a firm foundation. Sometimes you felt naked, exposed to the revealing light of my presence. I wrapped a robe around you, my robe of righteousness. I sang you a love song whose beginning and end are veiled in eternity. I infused meaning into your mind and harmony into your heart. Join me in singing my song. Together we draw others out of darkness into the marvelous light. Um, this is what Mass was about today. Like, these words. So I have goosebumps from, like, my head to my toes. The Lord appeared to us in the past saying, I have loved you with an everlasting love. I have drawn you with loving kindness. Look at that. I see, like, his finger drawing, like, in, like, gold writing drawing all of I delight greatly in the Lord my soul rejoices in my God for he clothed me with garments of salvation and arrayed me in the robe of righteousness as a, bi a bridegroom adorns his head like a priest and as a bride adorns herself with her jewels Isaiah 61 10 but you are a chosen generation a royal priesthood a holy nation his own special people, that you may proclaim the praises of him who called you out of the darkness and into his marvelous light. Peter 1. Wait, didn't I read this this week already? I'm like reopening to this. This is like, this is not bookmark at all. Actually, in fact, this page is. So that is really weird. And I'm just realizing now that we read this this week, right? It just means something different today. This is a good prayer corner. I'm like getting all sorts of 
goosies everywhere. All right, June 14th. Love you, Rudy. Kiss that. Ah, oh, it's going to be a good day, guys. Feel the light of the Holy Spirit. Love your people. Never know how long we get them for.